fair, open the door to Satan. When you hold a grudge against your brother because he offends you, you have already grieved God. When you hold a grudge against your brother because he offends you, you have already grieved who? God. Tell your neighbor, when you hold an offense against a brother, because he offends you, you have already grieved the Holy Spirit. So it means you have to be very careful. If God says you should not hold offense, those who embarrass you, those who wrong against you, God said don't hold offense. You have to be very careful. It means your enemy, your friend, good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. As much as you can, try. Try to live, live with them. Because tomorrow is a mystery. A war, a mystery. If in the past, if I did not know, tomorrow is a mystery. I will have offered the kind of prayer you offered. You know, you you want to kill your enemy when you are praying. Book your enemy, send back to sender. Because I, I never, I can never send back to sender. I can never send evil to my enemy because that enemy may be my friend tomorrow. If I now kill him, where will I get much friend God want me to have? Are you with me? Send back to sender. The dead, the trap they sent to me, I don't send it back. Because the one that sent it dead to me now may be my greatest friend tomorrow. So if I now send the same dead, send it back to them, okay, you are here today, and as 90% of us here are once said over my dead body, I will I come to sin alone. You pray, you fast, you pray against me. But I did not pray against you. That is why you are here today. If I pray against you, one prayer will have answered. It's either you kill or destroy me or I destroy you. But you pray against me, you rebook me, you ban me, I never do that to you. That is why you are, we are friends today. If I have also offered the same prayer you offer, over there, is it that your own destroy me or my own destroy you? But I decided not to offer killing, killing, destruction, destruction. You want me to die? And I said, no, you will not die. I want you to see the glory of God in my life tomorrow. Yes. The Bible says, I will set a table before you in the presence of who? So if you have killed your enemy, how will your enemy see the table the Lord wants to set before you? 